Bijie, turned deep in the karst mountains of Guizhou, used to be one of China's most impoverished cities. It was once known for its exceedingly barren land. After decades of strenuous efforts, the city has managed to rise above the poverty line. Bijie's success story has been noted by Chinese President Xi Jinping, who calls it a model of China's poverty alleviation drive. Haichu Village sits among the karst landform in Bijie. The village once suffered from severe soil erosion, with a forest coverage rate of less than 5%. In the 1980s, all 168 households here lived in poverty. Residents faced acute shortages of food and clothing. The annual per capita net income was only 33 yuan, or around 5 US dollars. Things began to change in 1988, when Beijing was approved by the State Council, Chinese Cabinet, as a trial zone for poverty alleviation. Backed by the central government and other state organs, Haichu Village pressed forward with planting trees. After years of hard work, pine trees took root in more than 800 hectares of land. The once barren mountains turned into a luscious green. <laughs> Just over 30 years ago, the per capita net income in Chengman Yuan village was less than 200 yuan a year. The village once struggled with severe deforestation and poverty, but it's now a major production base of citrus fruits. In the 1990s, villagers shifted from planting corn to cultivating fruit trees under the guidance of agricultural experts. This not only helped preserve water and soil and protect the environment, but also brought significantly higher economic benefits. On November 23rd, Guizhou announced that its last nine poor counties had been removed from the impoverished list, including three in Beijing. This also indicates that China had removed all poor counties from the poverty list. Xi Jinping Zong Shuji, Jiang Shu Bi Ye Gushi. 也是勉励我们要进一步理清理顺、生态建设、经济建设与社会发展之间的关系，在全面建设社会主义现代化国家新征程上不懈奋斗。